In the year 2029, an asteroid named Apophis, for the Egyptian god of chaos, will come within a range of 20,000 miles from our planet's surface or less. This is eye-wateringly close, especially when you consider that NASA puts out alerts for near-Earth objects when they come within a few million miles. And at that distance of a few million miles, NASA labelled these objects hazardous. Apophis is a huge lump of rock, the size of the Empire State Building, and it will be visible from our planet's surface as asteroid Apophis flies by at this distance. Ever since the discovery of the Apophis trajectory, space agencies around the world have been devising strategies to stop an asteroid striking the surface of the Earth, or even trying to divert asteroids in Earth's vicinity, as seen with the double asteroid redirect test. Other space agencies are sending satellites to Apophis, and this is to gain insight into the asteroid's trajectory, and also the best way to destroy such an object, should it ever be on a collision course with our planet. And now, scientists in China are saying our best hope will be to use nuclear warheads. Setting a nuclear bomb off in space is untested. Auroras would form, satellites would be thrown from orbit, and the force of the energy will have longer lasting effects, and affect more than just its intended target. Despite all the risks and the unforeseeable outcomes, China says that a nuclear bomb might be the only way to save the world, and indeed, these other circumstances are nothing compared to the devastation and impact scenario would cause. Scientists at China's Deep Space Exploration Program believe that nuclear bombs are the most effective option to prevent a dangerous asteroid collision with the Earth, which could pose a doomsday threat to humanity. While international law is against deploying nuclear weapons in space, and the risk of nuclear fallout causing interstellar pollution exists, devising long-term strategies and investing in nuclear-based defences to protect humanity from a potential doomsday event is vital. A large asteroid, about one kilometre or more in diameter, would have catastrophic global consequences, potentially causing abrupt climate changes similar to a nuclear winter scenario triggered by nuclear war. The Chinese researchers highlight several critical technologies needed to defend Earth from potential asteroid threats, and these include the ability to rapidly launch nuclear warheads from the Earth to target asteroids within a time frame of 7 days to 1 month, achieving precise strikes with an error margin of less than 100 meters after long distance travel, and ensuring the long term storage of nuclear warheads in space for over a decade. Their analysis indicates that if an asteroid were just one week or less from impact, a nuclear warhead would be humanity's only viable defence. A nuclear warhead with a yield of 1 million tonnes could deflect a 50 metre carbonaceous asteroid. However, if the asteroid were larger or primarily composed of silicon, a more powerful warhead or multiple missiles would be necessary. Setting a nuclear bomb off in space is untested, but it might be the only way to save the world from a possible impact scenario. But what do you guys think about this? Comments below. Thank you for watching.